I'm having a good time. This is fun. As much fun as windsurfing. <laughs> anyway, I, I just want to thank you for coming along on the hike with me. I know it wasn't exactly your first choice. Then we're even. Because I know you taking us on this trip wasn't exactly your first choice either. Okay. We're even. <laughs> What's for dinner? I'm hungry. Save. We don't eat for two hours. I was just asking. Andrew, you should have been there. I must have windsurfed for a mile. And my dad <laughs> sailed on his hands. So what'd you guys do? Find some real interesting moss? Hey, Jeff Coat. You should have oh, been there, Andrew. I hey, hey, hey. You yeah. enjoying yourself? Oh, it, uh, it's, it's getting a little cold. Cold? You think this is cold? Next year, I'm going to climb Mount Everest. Why? Oh, got to start small. <laughs> but first, an icy plunge. Hey, look at Kyle. Oh, leave me back! Oh, look at that! Ah, ah, ah. Oh, no, what a lousy oh. man. I don't feel too good. Hey, man, what's wrong? What's wrong? Uh, I have, like, this monster headache, and my stomach feels like someone shoved a knife through it. Just take it easy. Uh. Did you eat anything in the woods today? He had some wild berries. My dad said they're harmless. Did you have any? No, just Jeff and my dad. Well, I'm not a toxicologist, but these symptoms indicate nightshade poisoning. Your dad went swimming. We have to find him. I'll find him. Okay, boys, we have to move fast. Jason, run back to the van and get a dozen pieces of charcoal out of the bag. What for? There's no time, just do it. Give me something to crush the charcoal. I'll get a rock. Good. And wash it in a small pot in the lake. Thoroughly. You got it? Hey, hang on, Jeff. We're gonna take care of you. Good work. One of the properties of charcoal is that it's extremely absorbent. We'll crush it, we'll mix it with some water, it should absorb the toxins. Dr. Jeffcoat! Huh? Dr. Jeffcoat! Dad! Dad, are you, are you all right? Jason, get another blanket and keep him dry. Andrew, come with me. Where's the other blanket? Andrew, it's up to you. Okay. Turn this charcoal into dust and fast.
What is it? It's a man's drink. Oh. <laughs> it's a good thing Dr. Jeffcoat was here. It almost makes you want to study more. Yeah, let's not take this thing too far. Well, they seem to be doing pretty well. Heartbeat, breathing back to normal. We should get them to a hospital to be checked as soon as they wake up. Thanks, Dr. Jeffcoat. You saved their lives. Call me Dr. J. And anyway, it was a team effort. I told you he was okay. When? Do you know any scary stories? What are you doing? I have a perfect one. It involves parapsychology. You've heard of science fiction? This is science fact. O-B-E. O-B-E. Out of body experience. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. And it happened to me. I was on my way to the observatory. When my car mysteriously stalled, I started to get out of the car. Suddenly, I was blinded by bright lights. Then 